Effect 2, Episode 8. Last time we were on, we left, where I left off was we were on Alien. We were going to get ready to do the Justicar or the Assassin recruitment. So let's get to it, guys. All right, we got to go talk to Liara. You're Commander Shepard. I saw your... I guess you would say your aura. I'd recognize you anywhere. I was asked to give you a message if I saw you. It's from a friend you made on Novaria. What message were you asked to give? Shepard, we hide. We borrow. We build. But we know that you seek those who soured the songs of our mothers. When the time comes, our voice will join with yours. And our crescendo will burn the darkness clean. Thank you, Shepard. The Rachni will sing again because of you. I'm glad to hear that you're rebuilding. Are you somewhere close by? The Rachni Queen is not here. That message is one of many memories I carry from her. I encountered her on an uncharted world. She saved my life. More than that, she gave me a purpose. They are an amazing people, Shepard. The galaxy owes you a great debt for giving them a second chance. Thank you for giving me that information. I'm glad my friend on Novaria is doing well. Be well, Commander Shepard. You will not see me again. There's Parasini. <laughs> Holy crap, Shepard. I thought you were dead. Shepard? The news said you were dead. What happened? No, wait, probably classified. Forget I asked. You just have to lie. It's been a couple of years. I'm Gianna Parasini, Novaria Internal Affairs. You helped me nail Administrator Analeas. Happy question. to help. What happened to Administrator Analeas? <laughs> he made the one mistake Novaria won't tolerate. He got caught taking their money. He's doing a few years in white collar prison. More importantly, he won't work in the field again. Sit down. If I remember right, I owe you a beer. Yes, you do. What brings you to Ilium? You know, that you can talk about. You ever heard of the Collectors? They're attacking human colonies. I'm gonna stop them. Damn, Shepard. For me, a tough job involves more paperwork. Hey, listen, I just remembered something. I've gotta go. Talk to you later. And don't forget to drink your beer. like someone who needs high quality equipment feel free to look around my store has the best tech and biotic equipment on Ilium is everything here so expensive I'd planned to drop a lot of credits today really I'm outfitting a team for a dangerous mission I need the best and I'm willing to pay for it as long as you work with me well perhaps I could give you a preferred rate at the kiosk here a small discount and when I get special items in you can take a look what kind of special items are we talking about? Oh, you know, schematics, designs. Nothing illegal, but I may not have all the licenses to sell them. Do you have anything else? Anything not listed on your main merchandise kiosk? Well, there is one thing. Very advanced design. Not publicly available yet. That's because it's still in development on Novaria. And illegal for export. Hello, Hermia. Parasini! You set me up! But this isn't Novaria. You don't have the authority to arrest me. I don't care whether you go to jail. I've got all the evidence I need to find you out of business. 
Is that everything you needed? Everything and more. You're a lifesaver, Shepard. I, I need to go. I have to talk to my lawyer. Talk fast, Hermia. When the fines hit, you won't be able to afford him. Ah, oh, that was good. I've got to go file a few papers. Come by my table when you've got a minute. What's this? Let's go this way. Talk to Are you a Corian or Volus who is tired of being passed over for promotions because of discrimination against Ah, here we go. Hey, you! You! Shepard! Oh! <laughs> That one's for free. You'll regret the next one. Now, who are you and what's your problem? Like you don't know. Your friend came into my bar, harassed my people, and tried to get the deed to the place. That crap might fly on Omega, but Ilium has laws. I've got security feeds all over my bar. If you or your group bothers my people again, I'll have you arrested so fast, you'll redshift on your way to the prison transport. <laughs> Unless you've got plans to freelance as a bartender, <clears throat> something's not right. You should check out this bar. I'm Commander Shepard's squad mate, practically second in command. You don't want to mess with me. That's right. <laughs> Anybody Scott messing Red. with me will answer to my good friend, Commander Shepard. Hey. If you know this idiot, can you rein him in before I slap his ass with a singularity? Shepard? Is it really you? It's me, Conrad Werner. We met on the Citadel? I wanted to become a Spectre? You're alive. Oh, this is the happiest day of my life. Conrad, why are you acting like me? Well, you were gone, right? And the galaxy still needed protecting. So I decided to finish what you started in your honor. Why were you trying to get the deed to this place? This place is actually a front for a red sand dealer. I need to take it over to crack the ring. What? Who the hell told you that? The owner of that weapons store near the carport? She's an undercover cop. She told me about it when I introduced myself. Listen, crap for brains. First, we don't sell red sand. Second, red sand is legal on Ilium. You just need a license. I'll talk to this undercover cop and figure out what's going on. Thank you. If I kill annoying customers, it usually causes property damage. That comes out of my pay. Just let me know if you need any help, Shepard. Oh, God, man. Conrad. Conrad, Conrad, Conrad. Can't believe Conrad. I'm looking for the best tech upgrades you have. Of course. Hermia is going to be a very poor woman very shortly. Thanks for the help, Shepard. I love nailing Asari. So ageless and superior. Then you get them and they squeal like schoolgirls. How long were you after this woman? A few weeks, plus transit time. Not nearly as long as Analeas. Hell, at least this time I didn't have to wear heels and a dress. <laughs> It's been a pleasure, you. Gianna. You too, Shepard. See you around. Oh, hell with it. Mwah. Much better than an autograph. Take care of yourself, Shepard. Hello, Commander Shepard. Liara will be pleased to see you. You're Liara's assistant? Yes. Liara relies upon me to acquire useful intelligence. I don't have her network of contacts, but I supply her with supplemental data. It's really an honor to work with her. I'll talk to you later. Of course, Commander. Ah, 
Have you faced an Asari commando unit before? Yes. Few humans have. I'll make it simple. Either you pay me, or I flay you alive. With my mind. Shepard! Nixeris, hold my calls. Shepard. How about miss that? My sources said you were alive, but I never believed. It's very good to see you. You have sources now? A few. Sources, contacts, even a little hired muscle. I've been working as an information broker. It's paid the bill since you... Well, for the past two years. And now you're back. Gunning for the Collectors with Cerberus. That's not exactly public knowledge. Neither is you being alive, Shepard. Information is my business now. And if you need information on finding people, I'm happy to help. I'm looking for Thang Krios. He's supposed to be here on Ilium. The assassin? Yes. He arrived here a few days ago. My sources tell me he may be targeting a corporate executive, Nisana Dantius. He contacted a woman named Serena. Serena has an office in the cargo transfer levels. Perhaps she can tell you where Krios is. There's an Asari named Samara here on Ilium. Do you know where I could find her? Samara? Yes. She arrived recently and registered with tracking officer Dara. You can find Dara at the transportation hub. Thanks for the help. That's all I needed to know. Of course. If there's anything else I can help you with, let me know. I know you're looking for the Shadow Broker. Cerberus gave me data on where to find him. Interested? Absolutely. I had no idea. Let me see what you've got. It looks like a leaked transmission between Shadow Broker operatives. Some hints as to the location and... It's about Farron. He's still alive. Who's Farron? He was a friend. He helped me recover your body from the Shadow Broker. Why did the Shadow Broker want my corpse? He was going to sell you to the Collectors, but Farron and I stopped him. Farron sacrificed himself to save me. So... You rescued me. Then how did I end up with Cerberus? Well, they gave me intel to help recover you. They actually put Farron with me in the first place. After I got out, I gave you to them. They said they could bring you back. You kept me out of the Collector's hands. Without you, I couldn't have come back. Thank you. I didn't know how you'd feel when Cerberus restored you. If you'd feel betrayed or... They brought you back, and now they're giving me a chance to find Farron. After two years, yep. I hadn't even dreamed. Any friend of yours is a friend of mine. What's the next step? I... I don't know. I need to prepare to think. I'm going home. Use my terminal if you need any local intel. You okay? I've spent two years plotting revenge. Now I have the chance to make it a rescue. Let me help. I'll come by your apartment. Okay. Hopefully I'll have a plan by then. Thank you, Shepard. Hmm. All right. Ilium is the gateway to the Traverse. But is that gate open too we're wide? Not, uh, we're not doing the, uh, that DLC just yet. We're gonna do that in the next video. This video, I want to concentrate on getting all my uh, recruits. Listen, I know the data is vital to the Corosa family. The son of didn't give us time to pack. First, we're gonna go and talk to Zonjo. Zonjo has recently received an unexpected visitor in the form of a rare Jessicar calling herself Samara. Samara denied our request for an interview, leaving us. Trust me, the goods coming in from the Terminus systems are great for business. I don't know. Some of them seem dangerous. You're sure armor, gateway weapons and armor are good enough for Eclipse? I recognize that armor. You're with that other guy, Werner, Commander Shepard's friend. Did you get me the deed to the bar? I need the deed to, uh, stop the Red Sand Dealers. I softened up the bar owner, but you need to go in and finish them off. Really? Are you sure? Absolutely. You just need to close the deal. 
Go in, be tough, and let them know you're with me. They'll hand the deed right over. Wow, great. Here, I'll set you up for a discount. Thanks for the help. Cool. Cool, cool. Let's go, uh, assault rifle. We can use this! Submachine gun. And let's go over here and talk blue to this rose lady. Of Ilium. What do you want? Sorry, sorry, that damn Krogan's love poems are getting on my nerves. Is that Krogan bothering you? No, no, you don't need to hurt him or anything. He's harmless. Which, I know, Krogan, so it's hard to believe. His name is Char. We're kind of dating, but, well, we're on a break. And he's trying to show me how sensitive he is by, well, wooing me. It's really bad. So why are the two of you on a break? He's serious. Serious, as in talking about kids. Char is a great guy to date, but for something permanent... Krogans live long lives. It's not like dating a human where you just stick it out for a century till they die. Uh, no offense. It made me wonder if he really likes me, or if he just wants kids. He can't have them any other way, you know, because of the genophage. You have blossomed in a tower. You need to talk to your boyfriend. He's just gonna keep shouting poetry until you do. I know, but it's tough. I like him a lot. Hell, I love him. But I don't know if he's permanent bond material. Look at him, he's obviously crazy about you. Is he? I mean, what if he just wants to have kids? Am I just his baby-making machine? He said I wasn't, but... If he said that, then you either trust him so you have nothing to worry about, or you don't, and you've already decided. I, I guess I hadn't thought about it like that. And I do trust him, if he said it. I'm going to talk to him. Here, I've given you a discount at the terminal. Thanks for the help. Cool. What about you? Going to try and make it as a commando? Why not? If we sorry for biotics. For example, you know that new drug, the one that causes permanent neural scarring? That's horrible. There's a 12-page contract for shipping, then a waiver track. for use. Tasty veterans are just fire for the to the judge. My surveillance vids caught your extortion attempt from four different angles. I was misled! I was told that you had agreed to sell! Take her away before I have my bartender throw her out. Let's talk to Conrad. What happened? The undercover cop from the weapons kiosk just got arrested. She wasn't a cop. She was a deep cover operative from a terrorist cell. I'd never have found her if not for you. Really? Really. You did a great job, Conrad. Now please, go home. Let me take it from here. Can do, Shepard. And thanks. It's really <laughs> good to have you back. Cool. Uh, cool, 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 cool. So then he says, Oh, it's okay. Our amino acids are all different. So it's not like we get diseases or anything if we go natural. Alright, let's go do Dane. answer. That's why you need an Omnigel programming solution that works. Whether constructing single-use equipment or breaking down salvage gear. <sighs> do you have anything flashier? <sighs> I want something that says, I own this room. I own you. What we can do. Listen, I know the data is vital to the Kurosa family, 
The son of Dantius didn't give us time to pack. Serena? Who wants to know? Name's Shepard. Liara Tassoni said you might have information on Thane Krios. Tana, cover for me. Over here. Yeah, I know who Thane Krios is. I might have passed him some information, but I didn't hire him. What do you want to know? Hold on a second, you guys. Okay, where is he? Maybe you could help me find him. <laughs> I can tell you, but you won't stop him. When he contacted me, I checked up on him. The man never gives up on a job. I ran security for Nasana Dantius. Then I found out she was having people killed to cover up her dirty secrets. She fired me when I confronted her. Her loss. I might have been good enough to stop Thane from taking her down. Alright, where's Just Thane? Just tell me where I can find Thane. The Dantius Towers. Penthouse level of Tower 1. Yeah. There's a second tower, still under construction. If Thane is smart, he'll go in from there. It doesn't sound like Nisana is just gonna let me in. She's as smart as she is paranoid. No one's getting in or out of there without a fight. I can get you in, but you'll only get one shot. You'd better be ready. I'm ready now. That's what I like to hear. We'll go tonight, as soon as the shift workers clear out of Tower 2. Okay. Cool. are heavily guarded and you'll find more resistance closer to the penthouse. So, this assassin, you planning to stop him? I'm just here to make sure he survives. Hmm. There they are, the Dantius Towers. You'll have to get up to the second tower and cross the bridge to the penthouse. Her mercs will fight you every step, but it's your best chance. We might find him before it goes that far. Maybe. At least you'll know where he's headed. Alright, let's do this. Hold on. They'll be here to greet you soon enough. Good luck, Shepard. Guys, I'm gonna... I'm gonna end the video there. That was uh, episode 8. So, yeah. Feel free to subscribe, like, or comment on my videos. If you do like the video, hit that bell icon. And uh, <clears throat> it will notify you when I upload new videos. So, I'm gonna call it a night. And uh, I'll catch you guys on the flip side. Peace.